Don't feel any added stress because there's a camera here. <laughs> Only if you get my good side. You know, if I, hey, if I catch a really cool shot, I'll send it to you. There you go. <laughs> That's what I always tell people, I'm like, hey. So Rancho Del Sol is a killer course in Moreno Valley. It's got a cool opening tee shot. Pretty open. No, God, please, no, no, no! As you can see, we put it out right. I took the drop here. I'm just gonna try to play a little cut hybrid. This works out really well. It actually ends up on the green, just a little bit past the pin. Nice, simple uphill putt. Leave it short. Oh, you just had to give it more steam, Weston. Yeah, you're on the right line. for a bogey. So the next hole, par three, super cool, force carry over the water from the Lutees. It was like 147 yards. Shot a really good shot here. Long putt, story of my life, leave it short. Walk up, tap them for par. Next hole, par five, again, water on the right. Uh, I like to play a fade okay here. There, it works yeah. out okay. It's, it gets up in the rough on the left side. Kind of an awkward stance, but hit a four hybrid. Just crushed it. A little too much. Blows through the back. Get off the green here. Nice little soft chip up. Play a little runner. Runs out a skosh too much for my liking. Uh, at least myself with like a 12, 15 footer back up. This time, don't leave it short, but put it past. I thought it was going to bend in there, but we'll tap it apart and move on. Next hole, short par four. Play three wood. Cut right at the center. Worked out to be a killer shot. 50 yards in. Look at that, it's short. <laughs> Little lag put up here. I thought it was going to bend, it didn't obviously. Little par tap in. Moving on. This next par four has got a cool split fairway. Got to play something short, so I play a four hybrid up the center. Good shot. And I try to hit a three wood up there, and it's just too much. It just blows through the green. I get up there, have this little chip, and I don't hit it right, and it runs way too much. I leave myself like 18 plus feet back down the hill. Breaks on me, I miss it. Little tap in bogue. Super tickled about that. Next hole, shorter par four. Hit a killer drive straight down the center. With a nice little draw on it. Super happy with this shot. I'm gonna get down there, have a pitching wedge in, grease this thing. It almost blows through the back. I was astonished with how far it flew. I'm gonna have like a 40 foot putt for par. It's gonna break left to right pretty aggressively, especially down towards the hole, and I just don't play it enough. And I leave myself like a two and a half foot, three foot putt for par, and that's it. Moving on. Next hole, par five. It's got a huge fairway. I just blocked this thing out to the right. It was a pretty long, but not in the best spot. I kind of duffed this two hybrid. I don't know what I was thinking, trying to get it up there. Kind of have to slap this awkward live pitch shot up there. Getting to right next to the green side. Nice little soft chip up. This rolls up pretty good. I was really happy with this chip. And we tap her in for par. That was a Scramble for that one. That was a scramble and a half. I was just telling myself over there, I was like, way to turn a scoring hole into just <laughs> almost a penalty hole. Par three coming at you. I ended up hitting this pitching wedge just a hair too long. Ended up in the rough on the right side. Just trying to play just this like soft chip out, catch the rough, but I missed it and it rolls out pretty long. We got this par coming back. We get out of there pretty lucky just to save par and move on to the next hole. So last time I played this hole, I drove the green and you can see that I really tried to do the same thing this time. Why are you the way that you are? Ended up having to take a drop. 
don't hit the chip right. Ends up in the green side trap there, but was really happy with this chip out of the bunker. Left myself a really short bogey putt. Smash it in there and get out of there. Plus three heading into the back. Can't be too upset with that. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And join me for the back nine. That's where things get a little more interesting.